We go now to our reporter, Laura Windsor, who has more on concussion management. Your child is playing sports and falls and gets a bump on the head. But is it just a bump or a concussion? We spoke with Dr. Grace Mucci at Children's Hospital of Orange County who tells us more on concussions in children and the symptoms a parent should look for. The symptoms of a concussion vary between individuals, but usually the symptoms will be something like they might feel a little bit stunned at first, they could have some uh, dizziness, some balance problems, they might have some headache. In fact, headache is a very common symptom. In addition to that, they could have some fatigue or some other kinds of cognitive symptoms that you typically don't get with a bump on the head. Dr. Muji, how dangerous is a concussion in children? Parents often ask me, is a concussion life-threatening? or what are the dangers of concussion? And concussion in and of itself is a serious injury that needs to be tended to, and if tended to properly, will not result in any long-lasting consequences. Having said that, you know, when a child does have any suspected concussion, they need to be evaluated by a medical professional because there are some conditions in which uh, are life-threatening, and if a child is put back onto the field prematurely before that concussion has fully healed, then we are looking at a potentially life-threatening condition and that's termed second impact syndrome. And second impact syndrome needs immediate attention because it can be life-threatening and that's why it's important for parents and coaches and everybody involved with their child to be vigilant about the signs and symptoms of concussion. What are the typical psychological reactions in children following a concussion? The psychological reactions that children typically experience following a concussion are varied but can include depression, sleep difficulties, anxiety, irritability, mood swings, personality changes, restlessness, anger and aggression, impulsivity, and changes in motivation or apathy. What is the recovery from a concussion in children? Um, the recovery from concussion in children is a little bit different than it is in adults. Um, generally, and as a rule of thumb, most everybody will recover fully from a concussion. The differences are is that children take a little bit longer to recover. They may need a little bit more um, TLC. With so many children playing sports, is there any way we can cut down on these sports-related concussions? There are several ways that we can cut down on these number of sports-related concussion in children. Uh, number one, uh, is first and foremost, is education. And educating those individuals who are involved in the child's uh, sporting activities, such as coaches, trainers, parents, um, the children themselves. They need to be educated about what are the signs and symptoms of concussion. It is very important to keep our children safe. So if they're playing sports, make sure they're wearing their protective equipment so they stay as safe as possible. For the American Health Journal, I'm Laura Windsor.